So now we have our three cells with the different values for each month, and we'd like to add them all together. Well, you could make a simple formula, A1 plus B1 plus C1, but what if you have, I don't know, 50 cells, not three? That formula can get really, really long. Now, Excel knows that we're very often adding up different cells together, so it offers us something called the sum function. And we can use this function to add a bunch of cells together. Now, have a look at the first column here. In column A, I have numbers 1 through 10. And what I'd like to do now is add all of these numbers up together. Now, of course, we're not going to write A1 plus A2 plus A3 plus A4. That would take ages. <laughs> so instead, we're going to select the first 10 cells here. And now I'm going to show you a way you can add these all together. Now, I have a couple different choices, but the one I want to show you first is found here in the Home tab on the far right under the Editing section. And you see this Greek letter here, that's the letter sigma, and in Excel, this stands for sum. As you can see here, it says, display the sum of the selected cells directly after the selected cells. Okay, well, we've selected these here, so that means that the sigma button will display the sum directly afterwards, which will be right here in our little yellow box. All right, let's try that out. Click the sum function, and there we go. 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4, etc. is 55.